Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your July 2021 general reading. It is a general reading, so it will not resonate with every Libra, but if it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into this Libra. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Libra, we have an interesting spread here. We have the Two of Wands coming up for you. We have the Ace of Swords, and we have the Queen of Pentacles. All right, so for some of you, it's a decision between two different polarities. One is tried and true. It, it could be mon mundane, or maybe even a bit boring. You've already, you know this option. And then the other one is adventurous. It's fun. It's sexy. It's appealing. And you're caught between the two. Now, this could also be two lifestyles. Like, should I be couple, married, or just single? Just out here. Um, living my life the way I want to. It looks like some clarity is going to come to you. Or you're going to have a conversation that brings you a lot of clarity. Maybe even a bit of conflict before the, the clarity, before the resolution, but definitely one that will help you mull over things or help you determine things, help you add up things in your life or in, in put in right place, put in right standing. Some of you want to add something to your business too. You're not sure if you want to do. You want to expand something or you want to expand your portfolio in terms of how you make money. You're not sure because your need for control causes problems in your relationships. Now, relationships are business, platonic, romantic, or familiar, whatever. Um, so y your control issues, they kind of inhibit you or they stop you. Um, and this also could be in terms of love too. Your need for control um, kind of messes up the relationship or shifts the paradigm. You could be dealing with a Virgo. If you have the Virgo card coming up, the Hermit card coming up, it says that you're looking for answers outside of yourself, but you really know what the answers are and what to choose. Um, it might be two people that you have to choose. There might be some man that has to choose between two different women we got the emperor coming up with the queen of cups and then the queen of pentacles um you have a very intuitive empathic person who's on her own journey to self-discovery and self-development she may be coming off as aloof and uncaring and maybe that's making you uh kind of attracted to this person if you are a male or if it's same sex, but this person, this is making you attracted to that person. This other person you're attracted to this because it's tried and true. It's nurturing. It's caring. This could be the mother of your children or child. You know that this person is good in all different ways. Um, this could be a live wire, or you just you haven't really you're not able to read this person um, as as accurately as you're able to read the other person some of you just want to have affairs with no strings attached the fool card coming out you just want to have fun you just want to dive in um, you feel like things will come full circle with for you and with the person that you're supposed to be with. But something or somebody is playing heavy interference in your decision making. And they're causing for a lot of conflict. You also may have a lot of people in your energy. That makes it hard for you to be stable or make a stable commitment. Be reliable to one person. Even though there is a true love you have here. The Ace of Cups and the lover's card you do have a true love here um it's just that you're not able to offer this person much and you're able to get away with a lot you're able to go undetected in your juggling in your indecision and you're keeping things up in the air 
because this person is willing to work on things with you over and over again virgo coming up again uh, for you they're willing to deal with the situation and they think about you constantly and they might be a little bit more invested in the relationship than you invested could be money materials love energy somebody's more invested and you know that you you can get their forgiveness their forgiveness and their compassion and that they're truthful um even when you ghost them you leave them even when you're not even when you move away even when somebody's doing something that is i don't know it says whatever you're doing you need to meditate whatever decision you make meditate first um meditate you need to ask yourself are you really experiencing intimacy in your relationships i think nobody's getting close to you especially with you coming up as the nine of pentacles you're not letting anybody close to you you're maintaining a lot of relationships as the king of cups and this is my libra man um Wow, five of wands again, maintaining a lot of relationships, even though you could already have a family dynamic or an establishment. We're still dating. You're still out here. You're still striving for more. You haven't become comfortable within yourself or the relationship you're in. Um, you love fun times, good food, good women, fulfillment with the nine of cups here. I'm not exactly sure what is going to happen here, but I know that somebody is undecided. A decision might have to be made soon. People aren't going to hang on to much longer. Um, but then you do have somebody who's not giving up on this connection. Not for a long time. So, this is your reading, Libra. I hope that it resonates for you. Go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. Pay for your question. Receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. You can also donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so by clicking the Buy Me A Coffee link. Thank you, Libra. Many blessings to you. Take care.